Hey there beauties, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is really really special. So guess what? Trish McCoy just sent me their iconic best-selling products. Really excited to try these products on. So this video is basically going to be like a review video, like a first impression video. I have not tried these products before, but uh, also the other thing is, so yeah, it's going to be pretty much like my reaction uh, on trying them for the first time. So they sent me their four best-selling products. That is the first is the instant eye lift and um, the Trish McCoy Beauty Gloss in Rendezvous. And they also sent me like a similar shade, which is lip color in Rendezvous again. And I also got the Trish McCoy High Volume Tubular Mascara. And I'm really excited to try this one because I have seen pictures of it online. And when I open it, you will know why. If you guys are new here, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. So you're always in tune with what's happening around in the makeup world. And I post a lot in my community tab about new makeup launches, especially luxury makeup launches. So if you guys are new here, then I'm Shweta Deshpande. And I just talk about luxury makeup. I do swatches. And I am really, really passionate about luxury makeup and luxury beauty. If you guys are really interested in it, then do not forget to subscribe to my channel. So first up, we have the instant eye lift. This little magic wand basically just removes uh, all the tiredness under your eyes and brightens it up, giving it a really fresh look. So let's see if this really, really works. So I just have the e.l.f. Halo Glow liquid filter on my face right now. So I just wanted to try it without a concealer and see how this works. I am then just going to blend this with my fingers. I feel really hydrated, but the texture of this instant eye lift is creamy but yet it's lightweight after blending this instant eye lift i noticed that the texture of this eye lift is creamy but it's lightweight and a little fluidy at the same time i don't know if it makes sense to you but all i can say is that it gave me the coverage that i needed under my eyes it's bright in my eyes and also not too creamy for it to leave any fine lines but Except for that as well, it feels really hydrating and it doesn't feel too lightweight, but it doesn't feel too creamy at the same time. It's like the perfect blend in between, which makes it really, really great on top of concealers. So it won't over crease your eyes. Now I have applied it without a concealer, but um, so far I can see that my eyes feel really brightened. My eyes feel a little brightened and my face looks fresh. So I like that it's giving me the freshness that I need. So this is like 8 on 10 for me. Now moving on to the Trish McCoy High Volume Tubular Mascara. Now I got this in the shade Deep Aubergine. Now it's not black, it's a different color. I've got you guys a bit closer to show you. Just look at this color. I have never tried a mascara this shade and just carefully observe just notice the wand of this mascara it's almost like there is no mascara wand it's almost like there isn't any um like the shape that usually mascara wands are it's so flat and the only fibers or the bristles of the mascara wand is just on this wand itself it's not outward it's just flat so i'm really curious how this is going to apply so i'm going ahead and applying this it's like it's never going to end my lashes are just getting longer and longer you guys can notice the difference between this and this i am stunned and i absolutely love the shade this shade is I'm just going to swatch it on my hand. It's like a deep, it's like a mid-tone brown mascara. I've never tried this shade. Okay, now moving on, I got the shade lip color in um, Rendezvous. Now, this shade is a really pretty 
coral red color it's perfect for summers and that's the reason why i picked this up i just can't wait to swatch this and i've got like the matching gloss in the same shade so i can do like a really nice summer glossy look so i'm just gonna apply it now the texture of this lip color is so soft so soft i don't think this is a matte lipstick it feels more of like a creme satin lipstick but it's so hydrating the texture of this lip shade is like as if it's got oil infused in it it's buttery smooth i must say and i love love the shade so i remember this that i was trying to find like the perfect red coral shade because usually coral shades are either pinkish or they're too peachy but you can never find a coral shade that's red like a red lipstick or either it's too poppy for anybody to wear but i love love this red shade and i'm so grateful to have this i don't think that i can use the gloss on top of it because it's already so glossy but i'm still gonna go ahead and swatch the gloss on my hand this is just the same color any which ways so this is again in the shade number four rendezvous and the lipstick is also rendezvous so i'm just gonna sw swatch it on my hand you can see oh my god just look at this gloss again the texture of this gloss it's so buttery smooth it it's almost like i'm applying a lip oil it's so glossy and it feels really hydrating but it's not sticky i just gonna add a little bit on top of my lips is it the same shade but i just want to ha have a little more gloss i just want to see how this goes with the lipstick i think out of all the products i am i'm just so surprised with all the products i never thought that a mascara with like a minimal wand could just give me so much volume to my lashes and the instant eye lift is a product that i think is so beneficial for any makeup look i think i can use it on top of a concealer as well even without a concealer it performed so well that i love it i think i'm just going to be carrying it in my purse whenever i need like my eyes to be brightened or just have like a fresh look on my eyes i think um that's when i'm going to be using this because it's so smooth and it's so creamy but the texture i have never tried a product like this the texture of this instant eye lift is something which is really really unique and moving on to the lipsticks i'm just just surprised and i'm really astonished by the texture of these two products um they're so buttery smooth and they're so glossy but i don't think that they're uh I don't think any of these lip colors is transfer proof but I think I just love the shade and I'm really happy with the products that they've sent me if you guys enjoyed this video do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in another makeup video